everyone and welcome back to my channel today i have oh gosh three bags i'll only let this one a dollar tree haul y'all so i was watching oh my gosh what is her name i think her name is nicole on youtube she makes like strictly kind of strictly like dollar tree hauls but then she also does coupons as well is my camera like not what do i want to say balanced just like people think my life is not balanced. Hold on, let me try to fix it here. Oh. Okay, there, I think that's a little bit better. But anyway, I was looking for some specific items and then I just ended up buying like odds and ends or whatever, stuff I needed, stuff I didn't need, but let's get into what I got. So the one thing that I was really, really looking for um, that she talked about was, and she wasn't real sure if like Dollar Tree made a mistake or not, but they were selling these big boxes of, I believe, 12 count of um, Rice Krispie Treats, and they were like the long Rice Krispie Treats, and um, people were like giving her a hard time because she, you know, bought two boxes and she advertised that the Dollar Tree had them, and people were saying, you know, that that was scamming Dollar Tree because they should have opened up the box of the Rice Krispies and sold them individually, but yet the outside of the box did scan for a dollar for the whole thing. So, I mean, I don't know. I was looking for those, couldn't find them, but found some other stuff. So, you know how you hit the stationery first? Um, well, I didn't need any gift bags or ribbons or gift wrap or anything like that, but I did find these. Now, um, in my dresser, I want to say there's like one or two drawers in there that don't smell like moldy, mildewy, but they have that like, I don't know, like my clothes, I notice sometimes take on that like wood type fragrance. It's not really a fragrance. It's like the smell of wood and not that wood, the wood like from a tree. Anyway, and I picked up these sachets, these fragranced sachets. I don't know if you guys have seen these before at your Dollar Tree, but these are super strong, so I'm very excited about them. So this first one is a Lily, and for a dollar you get two of them, and there's a lot of like whatever they put in here, like the potpourri or whatever, there's a lot in this. So. It says that you can use it for bathrooms, trash cans, um, your car, which I think I'm going to put one of these in my car, vacuum bags, which who has vacuum bags anymore? Isn't it all just like bagless? But I don't know. Who knows? Closets and gift baskets. So um, yeah, this one is the Lily. And yeah, she's a floral Lily. She's super strong. And this next one is passion fruit. And then they all have like these little sayings on them too. Like this one says, enjoy every moment, delight and relax in the pleasures of continuous fine fragrance wherever, whenever you like. Passion fruit. So yeah, this one has like a very sweet kind of sugary, which is interesting because it's passion fruit. So I don't know, whatever. And then there's this one, my favorite. And they only had one left in this. This is the white rose. Oh, this smells so good. It's like a powdery rose. Like you would put like powder all over your body, um, like rose scented powder all over your body after getting out of the tub. It's like that kind of rose. So I'm definitely going to be putting this in like my Moo Moo drawer and things of that nature. So I picked up those and that was a new to me. Is it new to you? I don't know. I'll leave a comment down below. Um, also, random, I picked up another Lime Away toilet bowl cleaner. These are um, the thick ones. Now, they did have like another toilet bowl cleaner where it had more product in it, but those are super thin. Like it doesn't cling to the toilet and it doesn't have a good fragrance, I feel. This one works and I like the way it smells. It smells like eucalyptus to me, like a spearminty eucalyptus. So pick that up. And that's a repurchase. And this is another repurchase for me. It is the Salon Selectives Shampoo and Conditioner. This one is the something magic. I don't know. It's for Color Protect. Revitalize Marula Magic with Vitamin E. 
Um, so yeah, so I picked up the shampoo and the conditioner. I have these in my bathroom right now and are in my shower and they are pretty good and you get a lot, a lot of product in here. So it's 22.5 ounces for 99 cents. Probably not the best thing for my hair, but whatever. All this, all the salon people are probably screeching and screaming right now, but whatever. Um, and then I also found this, and no, I don't need room spray, but I was like spraying all this, all the room sprays and looking to see like what they had. This one is by Airwick, and it is Warm Apple Crumble, and it smells so, so good. Really, you hear the dog? Anyway, it smells so, so good. Um, so yeah, so I picked that up. I thought, you know what? If I want it to smell like apples or something, just spray it, let it smell like apples, live your life. Okay, let's get into the second bag. Let's see how much I spent too. I spent $21, so basically I got 20 items. Um. Oh, this, a wire cutter. So I was told to get one of these. I've been doing like floral arrangements and I've been needing a wire cutter. Um, I did two like smaller floral arrangements on each side of my huge TV in my living room that's brand new that I absolutely love. Um, and I didn't have a wire cutter so I had to like bend the flowers to um, you know, get them to stick in that foamy thing. But this is the wire cutter that I was looking for. So I did find that. For plates and things of that nature, they didn't have that many options. They just had the leaves. Um, so I did pick up two pot holders now. I will say this. These are strictly for decoration. Never, ever, ever use pot holders from the Dollar Tree if you are cooking because it will burn right through. Like, I've seen pictures, trust me, I am in the Dollar Tree community. I have been going through the Facebook groups and looking at all the products, like the new stuff that they get out, watching YouTube channels, and these are not good for actual use. So I am going to be hanging these on my oven, like one on each side, um, just as decor for the fall season. Um, and then I picked up some candy, oopsie daisies. I got some of the peanut butter kisses because I did find a candy jar um, that I wanted to use to put out when I do have guests come over. So these are the famous candy kisses. Love these. They've got the peanut butter in the middle and they're so, so, so good. I also picked up Tootsie Rolls because I couldn't find the big Tootsie Rolls, like the long ones that I usually love. So I just got the midgets. Oh wait, these aren't the midgets. Oh yeah, the midgies. So, oh God. You know what? Now people are going to get upset at me about that. I'm talking about smaller Tootsie Rolls. And then let's see what. Oh, and then I picked up this. They had like these masks and I thought, ooh, this looks like me. I mean, let's get our masks on. Oh, I thought it was going to be like one of these um, ones where, oh, I have to tie it. Are you kidding me? Oh, this is meant for a child, not someone with a big head like me. Anyway, you guys get the gist. When you're feeling sassy, when you're in that moment of spilling the tea and talking about things of that nature. I just thought that it was a good prop and I love it. They had all different colored ones. This one um, has the gold with the silver and then like a rainbow of different colored like little, not beads, but just fabric, whatever. But I just thought that it was super cute. But yeah, I thought that it was, um, you know, like that stretchy. So I'll just have to pre-tie it. So I don't have to tie it each and every time. And then you guys know how I'm obsessed with these little tiny notebooks. Um, I always pick them up at the Dollar Tree. I haven't seen any new ones recently, so I decided to get some of these that I found that are new. By the way, I'm sorry that my son keeps on going up and down and in and out because it's just, it's that kind of day. So anyway, this is one of the notebooks that I got. It says be unique. And these are really different because if you can see it's like a plastic that says be unique. And then you can always like flip it to the back if you want. 
and then you have the print and I think this print is really pretty with the butterflies but I love like what would you guys say that color is like a tea like a dark teal I really like that and then there's this one that I'm going to be giving my youngest daughter because her favorite color is blue. This one says, smile every day. And then this is the print that we have on here. Oh, that sun, y'all. It is just going down. And then my oldest daughter, her favorite color is purple. So I have the love. And then that's what this looks like. It's the floral print. And then this one I got for myself. And this is a hard cover, but it says, your wounds and imperfections are your beauty. And isn't that the truth? If we were all cookie cutter, the same plain Jane, wouldn't this be a rather boring life? You know what I mean? Like, I feel like being unique, being different, seeing each other's imperfections, that's what life is all about. You know, we make mistakes, we move on, bada bing, bada boom. So let's talk about what is in this third and last bag. I believe it's just a few little snackies. Um, oh yes, one of the other reasons why I went to the Dollar Tree is because I needed to get some sandwich bags and I always get the sandwich bags that are um, name brand because I just don't like the Dollar Tree bags. So these are the Glad ones and they are 22 in a pack. Um, they've got that easy, you know, seal. I also picked up, this is another repurchase for me, these garden vegetable crackers. They are so good and they are perfect in the turkey chili. So if you guys make that in the crock pot, this is a perfect pair for that. And then I found some new things to me. This was also on Nicole's little haul that she just had. Plus, I will leave her link down below if you guys are interested in following her if you are not already because she is like the dollar store queen, I feel. But anyway, she hauled these. These are the cookie butter and grain sandwich cookies she said her husband loves them her kids love them so I thought that I would give these a try and if I don't like them I can always take them to work and share um but yeah and I don't know who this guy is up here what is he doing like who is he he must be the mascot for the cookies or something I don't know and then the last thing I picked up um were these fudge mint fudge cookies Oh my God. These are like the Girl Scout cookies, like the Thin Mints, I'm guessing. But that is what these look like here, oven baked. And yeah, I just thought, you know what? I'll have them in the house. My kids have been coming over a lot more. And, you know, I like to have just like little snacky things for them to snack on. So anyway, you guys, that was my Dollar Tree haul. Thank you guys so much for watching. Um, if you found those Rice Krispie treats at your Dollar Tree and if you bought the whole box for a dollar, leave a comment down below. If you like me doing these Dollar Tree hauls and you wanna see more Dollar Tree hauls, thumbs up this video. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and I will see you guys all later. Bye everyone.